Okay. So. so. Oh, we're recording already. So we should get. So I, should, do I get started? Yeah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Take a sip. Okay. <laughs> Wait. Okay. <laughs> Hi, friends. Zoe here. So today is a very special day because we have a guest on the channel. This is Matt Raffi. Hello, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> Matt is also a YouTuber, and we literally met like 20 minutes ago. Literally, yeah. <laughs> like we met a while ago through like our channel. Yes. But then literally met for the first time like 20 minutes ago. Yeah, yes. Yeah. So YouTube brings people together. It does. It does. And Matt was kind enough to teach me how to contour today. As you can see, I'm looking quite um, Los Cabos. <laughs> <laughs> Gorgeous. Gorgeous. Yeah, so Matt's going to show us how it's done because he's profesh. Well, I'm not like a professional makeup artist, but I've done contouring a lot on my friends and like on shoots and stuff. So I'm excited. And you look gorgeous. So... <laughs> I'm going to, I guess, show you guys how I do contouring and kind of go through the steps, I guess, and like the products I use and stuff. So I hope you like it. Let's go. Let's do it. I'm so excited. <laughs> <laughs> so this is mostly going to be like contouring, obviously. Mm -hmm. um, we're not going to do like eyes or like any of that. I'm just like basic contouring. Yes, basic contouring. So contouring, basically, I feel like it's very different for everybody because we see all these different like contouring on Instagram and stuff like that. And it's like... Some of them are so intense. Like some of the girls, like literally put dots, or some of them like draw like a tree on their face, and they <laughs> like, like and they, like mix it everything. So it's very different for everybody, and like the colors you use and like the shapes you use of contouring. But basically, you have to go with like if you take your face, you go with like a three for like the dark colors, like the the darker color. You pretty much like draw a three like this down your jaw on each side, and then the white kind of goes around that so okay. i'll show you perfect great here we go here we go oh my god siri is literally <laughs> writing everything i'm writing <laughs> what are you doing okay. okay so for the contouring i'm gonna use um Ana how do you say anastasia uh, that's the girls at sephora anastasia Anasta anastasia yeah. I, I think anastasia yeah i say anastasia too like, okay like, let's say anastasia <laughs> Sorry, Sephora. <laughs> but I'm going to use Anastasia Beaver, uh, Be Beaverly, Beaverhausen. <laughs> Anastasia Beverly Hills for the contouring uh, because it's, I think, like just very easy to use and it has like everything already. They have the cream or the powder. No, yes, the cream or the powder. You have the, cr uh, the powder, but yes. I'm going to use the cream just because the cream, I feel like it stays longer and it's a little more intense. The powder is nice, but it's like, the effortless look, but we want it to be like that, like intense, intense, like <laughs> ready to go. So I'm gonna use a brush like this. I got this at Sephora. Airbrush concealer. There you go. So I'm gonna take the lighter colors here and like the ones that kind of match her face. This one obviously is like the lightest. It's called oh my god, it's called banana. And I'm gonna probably use more of the banana because she is lighter than I am. So there you go. So we're gonna take the hair out of your face so i'm going under the eye and you kind of go like where the light would naturally hit it um and that's it and then look up to go under the eye and really cover that part so as i go i kind of mix everything up like i don't like just use one i don't know because i feel like <clears throat> there's so many different colors on the like on the skin so you kind of like try to match everything but yeah so then I go on the chin here and then right above the lip. Um, Cupid bow? Yeah, the Cupid bow? Is that what it's called? I think so. <laughs> Cupid bow? I don't know. And then I go on the nose here, a little bit on the tip. And then I kind of skip the section right here and then I keep going above. And then I kind of hit the forehead. And the forehead here, I kind of go like that to here to here. So it kind of covers that like triangle section here. For now, that would be it. Now, I do want to take a little bit out at the end and like brush it on my, what's this called? Wrist. On my oh. wrist? <laughs> <laughs> I want to brush over the rest of my wrist here and then kind of grab a little bit and then go along um, just a little bit and then going under here. Now, these are the light parts. I usually do the light part first and then the darker part after just because 
just because. Now that's done, I'm gonna grab another brush. It's a flower brush. And <laughs> then, okay, so we have three on the, this is the light palette, by the way. Um, but it has three, again, it has three different colors of brown here on the palette, but I'm gonna use, kind of like mix and match them to like mix her skin tone. For the darker part of the contouring, this is like the real contouring part. Now, what you do, when you look forward, do like this with your lips, like... So when she sucks in her cheeks, you already see where those darker lines should go on her face. So we're kind of gonna follow that. So, okay, you can stop. <laughs> I got fish. Like I said earlier, when it comes to the darker part, you want to do like a three. So what's going to happen, the darker part is going to go around her forehead, down around her cheek, and then on the jawline. Perfect! Gorge! And then I'm going to go down the jaw! <laughs> so as you see, it kind of creates that three, right? So it goes like boom, boom, boom. I don't know, I'm not going to do too much nose contouring because like your nose is already so small. But I will like bring, I'm sorry again, I'm going to take the rest out on my wrist. Leftovers or whatever. And then I'm going to just bring down this line just a little bit on each side. Um to still define the nose, but there's no need to like contour majorly. And then go that space to here I left um, empty. This is where like the rest goes, but that's it. Not too much. And then the fun part where you look human again, <laughs> we're gonna blend. Normally I would have a blending um, sponge, like the beauty blender. Yes, the beauty blender is like $30 or whatever, but trust me, it's worth it. But because I forgot, like a silly person, I'm gonna use this simple little Close sponge. sponge. Yeah. Disposable sponge. I know. Even though I said all this about the beauty blender, <laughs> but trust me, it's worth it. To start blending, I'm gonna blend a lighter part here first. And then when it comes to the, the, the darker part, I'm gonna kind of start to push it up. Um, so that way this line here doesn't go down, it goes up to kind of meet the lighter part um, of the cheek. So as I'm going to start here, I'm going to push that part, not like drag it up, but kind of like as I blend it, I kind of push it up. So that's kind of what it looks like once it's blended. So if you look like... On each side, this side obviously not blended, so this is blended. Yeah! <laughs> so already it's kind of creating like a the high cheekbone kind of look. Now let's blend the other side! Here we go. We met two seconds ago and I'm already touching your face. <laughs> so that's how it looks when it's blended only. So already you see how like her forehead has like dimensions and like there's a the cheekbones happening. And she looks way prettier than I am right now. <laughs> so now we're gonna take a little bit of powder that like is her skin tone, and I'm gonna go over it to make sure it's like really well blended that way. Cause like you don't want those harsh lines and like any of that. Almost I'm gonna grab some of her. Oh my god, that's your bronzer? Yeah. I am dead. <laughs> Do you wanna see my bronzer? Like, ah! Literally, like this, I don't know if you can see, but this is black because of this light. It's like, anyways, this is really dark. That would be like my concealer, anyways. <laughs> so I will grab your bronzer and bronze you up and kind of like retouch where that three was from earlier, right? So like the forehead under the cheek and then on the bone. Like so. I look so tan. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> So, to finish the contouring part, we're gonna bring those cheeks out. For that, I have these two brushes and the amazing uh, Becca highlighter. Now, this is my favorite highlighter ever. I don't know if you saw the video I did, but yeah. girl, this is it. And I'm gonna use the color Opal. Game over. At first, I'm gonna grab this fan brush and kind of touch it like this and go over the bone, like smile for a little bit for me. There you go. And then go over it a little bit like so and then i'm gonna grab a smaller brush to um kind of go over it and make sure it's well blended in and not like patchy then i'm gonna touch a little bit here on the tip what is this called again chin 
the tip of the chin. <laughs> <laughs> like so. Um, and then I'm gonna touch, take my ring finger and then dab it and go on the cupid's bow right here to bring that lip out. And then a bit on the nose, like so, to bring that out. So then, so turn your face side to side. So it's like that natural glow that's coming out. So like her cheek is really popping out. So that's kind of what you want. So contouring is basically taking your face and like kind of um, redefining the lines to make your face stand out more. So like her cheeks are coming out more and like her jawline is more defined and everything is, she's even more beautiful than she was. Even that's, that's even possible, but. Aww. Thank so, you! So that's contouring! <laughs> oh my god, you look so good! <laughs> okay, so this will be the look that's done. The contouring is finished. Uh, she did a little bit of lip and eyebrows and like the redefine her eyes and stuff, mm -hmm. but this is it. You look fantastic. <laughs> Thank you! I am so happy with how this turned out. Oh my god, you look gorgeous! Oh, I look so <laughs> ugly next to her right now! Well, thank you so much for having me. Yes, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> um, and yeah. Don't forget to check out Matt's channel. I'll link below and I'll link like my top three of his favorite videos. Even though they're <laughs> all my favorite videos. <laughs> so don't forget to check all of them out. Like him, subscribe. Yes. And yeah, give us a thumbs up if you like this video. <laughs> Thanks. Bye, Bye guys.